Hi guys, thanks for joining us once again today. In this session, Owen and I have traveled north. We're fishing on the River Irvon, which is a tributary for the River Wye, and the target for the day is Graylin. Fortunately for me, I was actually on this river a couple of weeks back with uh, the guys from Fishing in Wales, and we had a fantastic day, caught some really, really good fish. And uh, hopefully, we're gonna repeat that today. Can't wait to get the rods out. Let's try and get some fish. So generally when fishing for grayling, we'll be using rods of around 14 or 15 foot in length, ideally paired with a centre pin reel, 4 or 5 pound line, paired with 16 or 18 size hooks. Normally I fish straight through with a bulk shot in pattern, and in this case a loaf of float just to cope with the fast water. I like to rove as much as possible and cover as many pools as I can in the winter time, because in general the grayling will be shoaled quite tightly at this time of year. Normally when you hit into one fish you'll get multiple and it can be absolutely brilliant sport especially compared to other styles of fishing which can really decline during the winter. So I've been looking forward to this grayling session for ages now. Been rewarded with a stunning grayling here of about two pounds. Absolutely made up. Um, I'm sure there's a few more in this pool. We've been searching for quite a few hours now so I'm going to get it back and we'll have another go. See if we can catch some more grayling. Excellent. This is such a difficult one to fish, isn't it? So deep. Well, it's actually taken me a little bit longer than I expected. And to be honest, a lot of this beat we haven't really been able to fish because it's very, very shallow water. You now this is a stretch that neither of us have been to before. So all we've been doing is walking down the stretch, walking down the beat, trying to find likely looking pools or, or deeper pools where we expect the grayling to be. And this pool that we're at now is the mother of all pools. It's absolutely massive. It's incredibly deep. And there seems to be a number of fish here. On that note, I've just managed to get myself my first one. It's not quite as big as the, uh, the one that Owen had, but a fantastic fish and exactly what we came for. Oh, this is where they normally go. Come on. <laughs> I think my hook might be too big, like, I've got a very big hook on. I'm gonna blame my maggots. Well, it's safe to say that we found a good number of fish in this pool now and we've not really got much time left of the day and we haven't really got much reason to move. So um, we are staying, staying put as we are. Every sort of two to three casts, I seem to be missing fish. And uh, there does seem to be a lot of small fish around, but I'm kind of holding out for, uh, for a bigger one because a lot of the fish I've had today have been around 10 to 12 inches, which is a good size fish. But for, for whatever reason, Owen's coming in behind me and he seems to be picking up the much better one. So. Um, yeah, the plan is to sort of solder on and, and, and try and match what he's done and get, uh, get amongst those bigger fish. Here you go, I'm in. That feels like a better fish. Feels like a much better fish. It's staying really deep as well. I'm not a fan of uh, playing these fish in this fast water with small hooks and light line, but you gotta do what you gotta do. Uh, come on fish. Oh, I haven't actually seen it yet. This might be uh, this might be my best one of the day. It's definitely the best one of the day. <laughs> Just seen him on the surface. Oh wow.
how's your luck? I, uh, I was literally just talking about you know, plugging away and keeping going and trying to catch a bigger fish because I've been pestered by small things all day. And I've just gone and got my best grayling for probably the past four, maybe five years. We just weighed it, it's two pound one ounce, an absolute monster by Welsh standards. Check that out. Really, really impressive fish, proper specimen. I'm over the moon to be catching fish this size. And that's exactly what we come to the Eurovon for. Absolutely amazing. Well, there we have it come to the end of another fantastic session only a short one today because the days are very short now it goes dark really really early and that's why we decided to get this kind of gear out at this time of year because it's absolutely perfect you maximize your time on the bank you get a lot of fish and you know when you have two two pound grayling like we've done today it doesn't get much better than that those fish are absolutely huge they're real specimens especially here in wales and if you've never tried this style of fishing before it's really easy hopefully you've seen that from the video today so why not give it a try? It's fantastic, really enjoyable. And uh, yeah, we are surely gonna be doing a lot more of it coming into the end of autumn now and into winter. Anyway, let's get packed up and head on home. I think we're done. <laughs>